What in God's name happened at the Place de la Révolution today? Germain was there, and I know what his plan is. You have to... You were told to leave that investigation to others. Yes, but listen! Yes, but listen? Is that the regard in which you hold the Brotherhood? I knew this would happen. I told Mirabeau that you were too obsessed with your personal vendettas. This is why I joined the Brotherhood. Yes, not because you shared our ideas or felt called to the service. For revenge. For redemption. Call it what you will. You've defied the orders of this council repeatedly. Pursued targets without sanction. And flouted our creed at every step. After Trenet. In light of these actions... I find I have no choice but to call for a vote of expulsion. What? You suck it. Master Bellier. Agreed. What are you... Master Kimar. Agreed. Arno Dorian, you are attainted. <laughs> Your rank and title are stripped from you, and you are hereby exiled from the Brotherhood of Paris. You cannot be serious. Listen, I know what Germain is doing. I can stop him. The decision of this council is final. We give you leave to go. Stripping me of my assassin's merit badge? Calling me a taint? To boot? God damn it. What has the city come to? Clearly, this council is what's tainted. It's what's corrupted. Anyway, welcome back everyone to a little more Assassin's Creed Unity. Oh my! The plot thickens. Oh, we're back in Versailles, really. The house looks like it's been ransacked. There's a dead rat! God damn it, did he kill that to eat later? Who knows, with all the rotten fruit, <laughs> rotten fruit and flies circling around. All right, he's certainly uh, not looking too great. Unless, have we gone back in time? No, he's definitely, you know, <laughs> a little upset. He's turned to the drink, yes. Damn. And he has drank himself dry in the process. No, no, no. Oh, what's he lost now? Oh, his his father's watch. Uh, I would imagine. Where is it? Either that or a, a lock of Big Red's hair. Yes, I don't know. Brasserie Garceau. Was that last night? I'll tell you, that's one. <laughs> that's one rough-looking growth he's got on his face. <laughs> Anyway, um, I'm back in here. It's been a while. <coughs> still, uh, the throat still bothering me a bit here. Get the hell out of here! But I, out! You've caused enough trouble for one night. Fine. I'll procure my wine in some other fashion. <laughs> All right. And now in some drunken stupor. Now I did see cherry bomb lures. Let's go to that. Oh no, I guess not. I guess not. Well, yeah, there's this strange tilt and sway to the... ...to the camera currently. I guess I'm trying to break in here and what? Steal some drink? Apparently. <laughs> How many lures did I get out of that? Oh, I got a trio! Well, that's something else, isn't it? Oh, damn. I don't know if he had to die. Damn. I don't know if he had to die there, Arno. Oh, damn. They're out for blood now. Goddamn, sir. All he was trying to do was track down a barrel of the good stuff. A keg of it, yes. Now blood has been shed. Now men must die. All right, but anyway, I've been getting in here. I'm getting in here. I mean, it's been a while since I've played. It's been well over a week at this point, I would say. Or, or a bit a week, you know. I've been sick. Before that, I, I hadn't really been playing for a couple of days. I had had intentions of maybe uh, not diving right into the main quest line again or the main sequence. 
but uh, but I have I have in the end done that um, because I think we're running a little long with this series now at this point and I think I'd at least at the very least just to ensure that I do do it bring it to some level of completion as far as the main sequence goes and uh, hopefully get to dead kings before too long as well you know um, and then, I mean, if there's more, there's if there are other things to do, I mean, there's still a pair of stories in about, and not to mention the fact that uh, a new patch came in just recently. Oh, damn, Eagle Vision. Off the menu, clearly. God damn, Arno, you've really let yourself go here, sir. I'm gonna get right up and over here. We'll jump into the piss pot here. Oh, got there just in time. Just in time. Can I get the grab on him? He seems to be a good distance off here. That's fine, though. So, I want to—I just want to make sure, I think I'm, what I'm going to do is I'll, I'll go hard on the main quest line for a, a few episodes, get into Dead Kings, and leave the Paris stories. And with this newest patch, Patch 5, I also noticed that all the uh, companion missions that were uh, specific to the companion app are now available as well out there on the map. They were just minor little tasks. I tried one out. Had to assassinate a target. It was really simple. 1,500. But the chests are open as well. And, uh, yeah. You know, it should have shipped like that, to be perfectly honest. But, uh, that's fine. Come here! I'll mash you like an old... Where did it go? Oh, again, I can't use that, can I? Not worth a damn. <laughs> right, what's he doing? Whipping the keg? Sounds like it. Putting a cork in it, at the very least. He's like, damn you, keg! Put a cork in it! Keeping me up all night. Alright, I'm not sure what I want to do here. Oh, it's on this level. Okay. Alright, that's not... I mean, I don't know why I'm putting myself through the uh, the torture that is the Ego Vision currently. Goddamn, Arno, you're pushing your luck with that one, weren't you? Did he make a sharp turn somewhere? Let's take these suckers down. All right. I don't know why I would even bother opening that. I'm not online and I can't- I still can't access the gold chests. So what I've been trying to say is, uh, there's still plenty of side work left to do out there. Whether I get to it in the actual playthrough, well, I'm not sure, you know. We're running- we're, it's beyond three months now since the game launched. This series has been running for three months, plus. Oh, it was last night. Maybe I left it there. And I think I'd like to bring it to an end sometime soon and get into some other games here on the channel. So, I don't know. At the very least, I want to get through the main sequence. I want to get into Dead Kings, get through that. And then if I if I feel so inclined, if I, st if I feel like I still want to play it and, and still want to keep a, a spot reserved for it here on the channel, um, then I will get to the Paris, uh, some more Paris story action, uh, some of those companion missions, maybe some of the co-op, some of the heists, and stuff like that. You know, I don't know. I haven't really decided yet. But I think some of you, I'm sure, will enjoy the fact that... Uh, ...that I'm going to focus my efforts on uh, bringing this main sequence to completion over the next few episodes. And I'll tell you, it's good to be back on the mic, you know. Away from it for about a week, you know, just kind of... Uh, just I, Well, I couldn't. I could hardly talk, you know. <laughs> it was pretty bad. So I couldn't work the comm at all. And, uh, well, when you're do a live comm, I couldn't even play. So, yeah. Yes, this game, it must run its course eventually. And I think, you know what, sometimes, and I have to admit, I really do drag my series on. For some games, I mean, some stuff it works well for, like Skyrim. But uh, some games, I, I know I drag on far too long. You know, at the three-month mark, things should be coming to a, to a close. You know, at the one-month mark, in most instances, I think things should probably be coming to a close for any given series, you know. 
Alright. All right. I'm right back at the old, uh, the same location now. Here we go. Oh, Christ. Not huh. you again. Didn't do enough damage last night. No, I, I just... My father's watch. Have you seen it? I see nothing. Might want to ask one of the four men you picked a fight with. Idiot. So I'm definitely a little lost here, you know. He's uh, he's been stripped of his uh, assassin credentials. Watching. Turned into a drunkard. <laughs> the town. You don't want to do that, boy. The town troublemaker as well. Oh no, the funky hat crew. Good lord. Arno has a chip on his shoulder, and he's got something to prove these days. And I'll tell you, what the hell happened to Elise? Oh, damn, really? You suck. Oh, <laughs> got you napping there, Brutus, didn't I? Yes, I did. This is a good little fight. There's still a couple, hung uh, a couple of the uh, funky hat fellas out there as well. Here we go. Now the big boys are in. I gotta get rid of Brutus. Damn you, Brutus. Get out of here with that. He is swinging for the fences. Looking to lop off a head clean. Yes. He, I don't think he even cares if it's Arno. If somebody in the in the crowd gets uh, suffers a little collateral damage on a wild swing, well, so be it. So be it. <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. God damn. Alright. Enough dicking around with the fireworks. Oh my god, with these uh, bloody stun grenades. There we go. I wonder if I could have died in this, uh, in this fight, you know? I don't know. I certainly have been guzzling the good stuff, though. A little opium to go with Arno's steady, uh, steady injection of wine. Or whatever it is he's drinking. Oh, no. Now I understand. That's right, he was looking for his watch, and now he has found it. The memory has been... has been jogged. Funky Hat Man will suffer, yes. Have we found him? There he is, right there. You. Uh, where's your boss? Oh, shit. No, get back here. Where are you going, fool? Goddamn. All right, if, now, I feel as though we've come full circle here. Arno, don't be taking your time dicking around with stuff like that. Come on, man, get up and over. Oh, my God. Well, that has just, uh, this chase has gone to shit real fast. You know, I, why are the streets so deserted, you know? Versailles was a very li uh, a very lively place when the game began. I your last night. Decided I don't owe you anything. All right, finally just beginning to make up the uh, a little ground after the uh, the opening blunder here. Down you go, fool. Give me my watch back, sucker. You know, it was uh, one drunk running for his life, another drunk 
chase and to try and retrieve a valuable. Yes. Yeah, Where? No wonder the chase. The <laughs> the 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 Thank you. Good lord. Why would you even bother growing growing something that looked like that? <laughs> it was a bloody mess. Uh, but a uh, new patch did come in recently. I think I made mention of that when I when I tied it into the fact that all the companion missions are now available. Uh, you know, I think maybe over the course of these patches being released, I think I've lost some quality in gameplay, in, in actual graphical quality. But performance has, uh, has you know, well, I think it's increased a little bit over time, you know. All right, now what am I doing here? Tackle the thug, complete. Find the gang leader. I have no poison, so that's out the window immediately. All right. Oh, well, I have the berserk. I don't think that would actually work, though. Beautiful little opener. Right now, is he still suffering from the uh, the hangover eagle vision? It looks like it. Yeah. This... How how do, how in the hell did I miss that? There we go. I don't understand it. I mean, it's like I got a clean hit on his on his noodle, and uh, and he manages to to take it like a boss, like a true champion. Was he wearing a funky hat? Did it perhaps lessen the uh, the full severity of the blow? I'm not sure. Huh? That's odd. What is that now? Ah, oh, the marksman coming in my way. Shit is about to hit the fan as soon as I stick this fella right here. <laughs> Alright, wonderful. Nice little uh, place to be, uh, be scrapping it out, you know. Out here in the master ballroom. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, I got in between his attack and uh, did him dirty as I went straight for the crotch. Yes, straight for the groin. Oh, chopping down the tree. Taking down this roguish wannabe. Dunk. I better, you know what, I better go looking for a little medicine. I did take a little damage there. Look, I've got none. That was my last one. Suckers, you better have something here. A bottle of wine or anything, clearly. That is replenishing the health at this point, you know. As uh, Arno has become, well, a drunken master, yes. Assassin style. Whoa, what's happening here now? A little stutter action coming in. Oh, here we go. Following ghosts from our past. Memories. Oh, damn. <laughs> I'm glad Elise enjoyed that as well, yes. Look at all this. Even the chamber pots are gone. The piss pots? Stolen? You don't say. Who would do such a thing? What is this guy doing then? Damn, sir, damn. Ay, ay, ay. I hate to do a man like that, but, uh, well, screw it. <laughs> it's just that's just terrible. Oh, you know what? I need to be on the lookout for medicine. What can I say? You were always a bad influence. Oh, you were worse. Clearly, that's a little uh, memory going on in the next room, which is where we finally got a little sugar from the woman after tracking her down, only to be rudely interrupted. Actually, no. Was was that happening here? Yeah. This here is where I leapt out. <gasps> What 
does this guy think he's doing? With that goddamn pistola. Oh my god, are you kidding me? How many times do I have to roll before he... I mean, he had the shot lined up. Or he, at least he should have. Clearly he was a rookie marksman who got a little lucky. And managed to take advantage of uh, a drunken situation, yes. A poorly timed roll. Arnold becoming jester of this court. He's lost a little of his edge here. In his premature retirement. His drunken... His drunken days here. Post-war. Alright, now where am I going here? Oddly enough, I don't remember. Okay, here. One more room over. As if I got stuck all the way back to the start of this. I'm not even uh, too concerned with trying to play it stealth. You know? <laughs> I just, I don't even care. I, I, cause, you know what, to me, actually having a little sword play here in the main ballroom is, uh, is much more ideal. In these dark and, and gray days, you know, gray skies above. Oh, done. Get out of here with that, guys. It ain't happening. All right, should I bother looking for the medicine right now? You know what? I real—I don't think I had much coming in to this part of the mission, so I think it would be a smart choice to go looking. As clear that was my downfall in the last. Well, it was part of the part of the downfall. The fact that the man uh, took forever to line up the shot while I was rolling wildly, like some sort of acrobat lost from the circus. Oh, damn. Making y'all look foolish. Pair of rovers. Well. Scallywags. No, sir, you're denied. Stuff the last, last second. Drunken master style. Yeah. Alright. We'll take another look for a little medicine here. I will let the marksman live. Arno simply wanted to see the man squirm in pain. Figured it was more fitting than a quick end. Alright. Uh, now, the marble, I mean, it just looks stellar. At least... Well, I think more so in this, uh... What was that? In this structure than, than in others, but... I, I really take notice of it here. You know, I did at the you know, start of the game, when we first arrived... In the world of you, eh? Oh, damn you, sir. Take advantage of me. Tied up with Bruce. Oh, <laughs> you're right. You're right about that, sir. Oh, I nearly took them both down. That big old shoulder charge. Oh, <laughs> damn. Arnold not wasting, wasting a step. Love. Alright, now... I did take... I did suffer one slice... There goes the last of my medicine. I still have yet, despite searching every corpse here along the way, I still have yet to pull, uh, pull a little opium off any of these suckers. What is it that I can hear ringing in the background? I don't know. There we go. One vial of the good stuff. What can I say? You were always a bad influence. Oh, you were worse. Christ. We may. <laughs> Andre, you're about to join your friend there, Pierre. Oh? Yes. Damn traitor! Oh, no. I've got you, mother bastard! <laughs> You know, why doesn't it sound like my shots are actually hit? I hate it when it does that. 
work your way behind him. There we go. Get rid of the spearman, because you know what? He can turn the tide quite quickly with one little charge with his spear. He'll run you through just like that. And put an end to your great run. Yes. At least he has to me. He's done it to me in the past. It's well documented here. Once or twice, I remember. Quite clearly. All right. There we go. What am I trying to where am I trying to get to now at this point? Is this not the way I, I came? Diablo, is that me? Looks like <laughs> Alright, who was he talking to? I don't know. Next room perhaps. Oh, here we go. Back here to where uh, the old man got murdered, got put down. Can't I go with you? You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. And Arno, no exploring. Hmm? Yes, father. Do I, I wonder if I have my disguise of it. Oh, Arno, what are you doing, sir? Oh my. He's got a uh, an itch he just can't seem to scratch on his backside. There he is. Like a dog, you know? Like a dog dragging his <laughs> dragging his ass across the carpet. <laughs> That's what Arno's doing on the edge of that wall right there. Good lord, sir. Give it a rest. There you go. Alright, well, I hit my turn. Still got a couple of funky hat fellas here to deal with. And uh, Arno ain't gonna mess around here. No. We're not going all the way back to start at this point. I saw that uh, that stun grenade getting getting cocked by the one fella. By this fella, in fact. And uh, I said, no, sir, it's not gonna happen. And of course, this guy over here, completely unaware. What are you doing, sir? Arno, Arno clearly has that scratch again. Walking a little funky there. We'll put this fella down. Should I go hunting for a little bit of a uh, little bit of medicine? You know, I may need it. But anyway, here we go. At the very least, I'm going to search him. Trigger the next portion of this mission, which I hope is coming to an end because we're running a little short on time. Yes. Because of my uh, tomfoolery. And it will all be made clear in this one moment. Something he had missed. From times past. Perhaps just the sorrow penetrating his oh, no. heart once more. To sober him up. You look like hell. You look like you want something from me. That's a fine thing to say after you up and vanish. <laughs> you made it fairly clear you no longer required my services. Don't. Don't you dare talk to me like that. What do you expect me to say, Elise? Forgive me for not letting you die? I'm sorry that I care more about you than about killing Germain. I thought we wanted the same thing. What I wanted was you. I can't bear the fact that my carelessness got your father killed. Everything I've done since then has been to fix that mistake and to prevent it from happening again.
You must have come here with something in mind. What was it? Paris is tearing itself apart. Jama has driven the revolution to new heights of depravity. The guillotines operate nearly around the clock now. And what do you expect me to do about it? The Arno I love wouldn't have to ask that question. You're better than this. I'm going back to Paris. Are you coming? There's one last thing I need to do. All right. I'll go see to our transportation. Stay out of trouble. Well, I'm kind of... It's kind of good. I'm, Don't get caught. You know, I like this little twist to it all. The way he gets, you know... Tossed aside by the assassins. Elise tossed aside by the Templars, you know. To, uh, force to stand alone against tyranny. And, uh, well, there we have it. And uh, the other thing that was nice was that we were we were brought back to Versailles at some point, you know. Uh, across the main quest line. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to wrap it there. We are running a little bit long. Not a, uh, not the greatest of times, I would say, as far as an episode went, you know. Uh, I was, uh, running around a, a little, I don't know. A little aimlessly there for a little while. A couple of botches. Uh, but uh, just getting in here fresh after being away from the game for a while. And just trying to, you know, I don't know. I, I, I Trying to clarify how much more I actually want uh, to do for this series here on the channel. For this game in particular. It's, uh, I mean, there's, there's a number of factors. You know, I, often I'm dealing with, with problems with the game. But if Patch 5, you know, this was a pretty clean experience here. I was kind of pleased with that. Uh, but if Patch 5 has helped to resolve some of those issues, it may make moving forward with a lot of the side content uh, a little bit easier to bear. Uh, also, you know, there comes a point where I think that the interest in the game has kind of run its course, you know. And I, I'm feeling that right now, you know, not only from personally, but also from some of the, just the kind of the viewership that comes in for, for this series. I think maybe I took it a little bit too far with some of the Paris stories, etc, etc. So, main priority right now, we'll get through this main quest line. We will get into that Dead Kings DLC that came in for free. And uh, and if there's a little bit more time, if I feel like I would like to continue it all, the rest of that uh, side work will get completed as well, or at least a good portion of it. Maybe a little co-op with a friend. I don't know. I don't know. But, uh, I can't guarantee anything. I'm not going to promise anything right now. But uh, for sure, I'm going to try and stay on the rails of the main quest line at least across the next few episodes. I hope some of you will enjoy that. I hope to see you there when those episodes roll out. But of course, until then, remember why it hurts. Later. <laughs>